Hello, class. Hi, guys. Can you hear me? Can you see me? Can you? Hi, guys. Can you see me? Can you hear me? We didn't need this shirt, Jess. We can hear you. We can see. Okay, good, good, good. All right, welcome everybody. How are you? Hello, welcome. Hi guys, good to see you. I cannot hear you. You can't hear me? Hi, teacher. Maybe it's my device. Is can you guys hear me? No? Yes, teacher. Oh, okay, okay. All right. Please let me know because I I I I have no way of knowing unless you guys tell me. Okay. Um, all right. Well, good to see you guys once again. How are you guys doing? I will leave and, and get in again, teacher, if you hear me, because I'm not able to see you, to hear you. You can't hear me? Oh, okay. So maybe it was it was her her connection. Okay. All right, guys, welcome. Welcome to today's class. How was your day today? How was your middle of the week? Good, bad? My good evening, evening. teacher. Good evening, Luis. How are yeah. you today? Uh, yeah. I'm fine, I think. I find a lot of work, a lot of things to do, and issues and I have to handle. But I'm here. A lot of issues to handle? Yes. Oh. I can Sorry. Hi. Can you hear Hi. can you hear me now? Yes, teacher. I was uh, trying with a different headset, but uh, <laughs> it seemed I would be no, they don't do not work, but I will be using a different one. Oh, okay, okay, no problem, no problem at all. Okay, um, okay. So in that case, um, well, I'm glad to see you guys uh, once again, and um, thank you guys for completing um, the the platform. Well, what you had to do in the platform. Um, today that I was uh, I was um, sending the grades, I noticed that um, many of you have well, you finished unit two, you finished um, the the midterm, and some of you have already started with the final. Um, so this is wonderful. Thank you very much for for doing that. Um, it's going to make a difference there. Um, when at the end you won't have to be like rushing. So that's great. Thank you guys. Okay, well, um, and do you guys have any questions? Anything that you had problems with in the platform? No, did you? For me, no. Me neither. No? Okay, good. All right, in that case, um, okay, let's take attendance then. Let's start with the attendance. Um, all right, so. Of course, our first one is Ana Claudia. <laughs> Present teacher. <laughs> All right. Okay. Um, and, uh, Javi? Javi? No? Javi's not here? Okay. All right. Uh, Andres? No? Okay. Uh, what about, well, Dennis Orlando, I guess not, right? No, okay. Uh, Edgar Menjivar? Edgar, no, okay. Uh, what about Edi Chorleni? I suppose not. Okay. Irvin? Hi, teacher. Hi, teacher. Hello, Irvin. Okay. Hello. You're, you're in a different place today. Ah, yes, yes. 
Thank you so much. Yes. Yes, I can see your you've changed your your normal position. <laughs> yeah. Is it more comfortable from there? Um, yes. Yeah. Okay. Good. Yes. Good. Good. Okay. Uh, Fabiola, I guess not. Um, Haiti. Haiti. Sorry. It's okay. All right. Welcome, Haiti. What about Irene? Is Irene here? Present teacher. All right. Welcome, Irene. Good. Okay. What about Ivan? Is Ivan here? Yes, present teacher. Good evening, everybody. Good evening, Ivan. Okay. What about um, Josue? Present teacher. All right. Welcome, Josue. And do I have one, Francisco? Present teacher. All right. Welcome, Juan Francisco. Okay. And what about Jerry? Is Jerry here? Jerry? No? Okay. All right. Uh, what? Are, oh, no, wait a second. I do. Jerry, are you there? It's, I, I see he's connected, but I just don't know if he's there. Jerry? Oh, okay, so he disconnected. Okay, all right, so I guess he's having problems. Uh, Luis, Luis Ernesto? Present teacher. All right, wonderful, and welcome. Manuel Alejandro? I guess not, right? Uh, Natalia? Present teacher. All right, welcome, Natalia. Wendy? Is Wendy here? I guess not, huh? Okay. Warner? Warner, are you there? No? Good evening. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Okay, Warner is not here. What about um, Yvonne? Present teacher. All right. Well, welcome, Yvonne. Delighted to see Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, um, Yvonne, you you uh, I saw that you uh, you were able to get ahead in the platform, mm. right? No. Yes. Yeah, that's good. I'm I'm glad you were able to do that. Okay, good. Um, Edgar Enriquez. Edgar Enriquez. No. Not here. Okay. All right, what about Eli? No, Eli? Okay. And what about Jose? Jose Montes? Jose Montes? Okay. What about Jose Ayala? Present teacher. All right, welcome. Good to see you. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Okay, well, I'm just going to go one more time, making sure that I have everybody. So, Javi? Andres? Present teacher. Oh, okay. Wonderful. Welcome, Andres. Thank you. Uh, Dennis Orlando. Uh, Edgar Menjivar. Present teacher. All right. Welcome, Edgar. Uh, Edith Chorleni. <laughs> Irvin. Oh, no, no. Sorry. Irvin. I, yeah, I got it. Never mind. Forget it. Uh, Fabiola? No, right? Uh, Wendy? Oh, present. Welcome, Wendy. Thanks. Werner. Present. All right. Welcome, Werner. And uh, Edgar Enriquez. And, and Jose Montes. Okay. All right, guys, in that case, that's it. That's all the people. Okay, great. I'm glad um, you guys are able, you were able to connect. Thank you guys so much for your, your effort. I know that, um, you know, there are always certain situations that make things difficult, especially with the rain, you know, because I know it's raining a lot at nighttime now. 
um, you know, so that that makes all the things a little bit difficult sometimes, but I really do appreciate you guys um, put it all of your effort into connecting, um, you know, from your cell phones. Um, some of you I know that you connect while you're driving, or, you know, and, you know, that, that all of that shows really how much you, um, you're committed and how much you appreciate this opportunity. So thank you guys for always doing that. Okay, so we're going to start. Um, oh, by the way, before I, I forget, uh, you should have received uh, you, by email the, um, I think they were, what was it? They were surveys, I think they were. Did you guys receive the surveys? And I get it in the message. WhatsApp message. Okay, good, mm -hmm. good. Okay, so you got the WhatsApp message. Okay, so not by email, but, but WhatsApp. Mm -hmm. What about the documents? Did you guys get the information for the documents as well? Oh, uh, no. you mean the, the documents to no. yeah, for the next course? For the next yeah. course, uh-huh. Ah, but that would be a chart full think... face. I think uh, in my in my case for uh, is for human resource in the work. Okay, but uh, I consulted with that. Yes, mm -hmm. please, please. Okay, um, because we we are in the middle of the course already. You guys know that we're actually past the middle of the course. Uh, we are starting the third. The, the yeah, we're starting the third um, week, mm -hmm. right? Um, and we need the, the, the oh, no sé, no sé. sorry, oh, bueno, no sé. <laughs> I think that was not for me. <laughs> okay. So anyway, uh, Evan is in the house. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. Uh, okay. So anyway, um, you guys, uh, should have received the information for the documents. I know that it feels like a long time, um, you know, until we start again. But remember that it's just because of the of the vacation, right? That we're not going to be um, having class during the vacation, which is next week. But that doesn't mean that um, it, that you like that time doesn't count, right? So you guys, if you can um, talk to human resources, make sure that everybody has on time, because this is the other thing. I want you to guys understand this. If we do not, if we do not um, give in the documents on time, we start late, right? I mean, because we don't, not everybody has given the documents. So that means that instead of starting when we're supposed to start, we're gonna be starting late, okay? And if we start late, basically your your learning process gets you know it it, it it it's longer right so instead of doing it in i don't know two years you're gonna end up doing it maybe in two years and a half or something like that i don't know i'm just I, i'm just putting a number right but the what i'm trying to illustrate here is that the process gets um you know backed off right it's it's the same 18 levels but because we have um you know we have the 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 um, backups because we uh we weren't able to get all of the documents on time the, that adds one week and then another week and then another week and then in total we end up losing many weeks and that ends up being many months in the end right so that's why i'm telling you guys if you can you know, make sure that you start that on time, that would be better for your interest, right? So that you guys can finish the whole, um, you know, course in short, in a shorter period of time. Does that make sense what I'm saying? Or, yes, or did I just- Yes, teacher. Okay, okay, good. Yeah, so, so if you guys can do that, that would be wonderful, okay? Um, and the survey, um, this is the survey, this is the, the survey that has been sent is the internal survey, okay? So that is the one that, um, that is for, only for English. For you. Yeah, 
Exactly. So that means that you can do it at any moment. That one, you don't have to wait. The one, the survey you have to wait is the one from Insaforp. You have to wait till the last day of class to be able to do it together as a class. But the other one you can do whenever you want. Okay. In fact, if you can do it, um, the quicker, the better, right? Because that way you get that out of the way. Okay. Any questions that you guys have? No. No? Okay. All right. Okay, guys. So what we're going to do is start with our PowerPoint so that we can start right away. Um, please tell me if you can see my PowerPoint. I mean, we usually do are able to, we are able to usually to see it, but I just want to make sure. Everybody can see it or not yet? Yes, yes, teacher. Yes, teacher. Yes, teacher. Okay, so. Good evening, teacher. Hello. Sorry, I didn't get who, who, who said good evening. I wasn't able to see. Sorry, okay, sorry. Well, whoever said good evening, good evening to you back. <laughs> I, wasn't, I wasn't able to catch who it was. Okay, all right. So anyway, this is the intermediate module one, um, unit two procedures, uh, date Wednesday, July 28th, 2021. It's in 16, facilitator Jessica Guerrero. Okay. All right, so creating an evaluation list. This was something that we started last class, and I told you guys that we were going to, uh, you know, start last class but finish today. So, in pairs, in pairs in your assigned um, breakout room, use the evaluation checklist in the last slide as a model to create one of your own. So you're creating a checklist, an evaluation checklist. Evaluate a process you follow at your workplace. Share your checklist with the class. Okay, so um, you guys started, but I think you need more time, right? I'm guessing you need more time, right? Yes. Okay, so we're going to get you guys to work back. We're, I'm going to get you um, back into your group so you are able to finish off. Um, do you think you can do it in about 12 minutes? You guys need about 20, 12 minutes to to create the checklist or do you think you need more time? Mm, I think it's too much. Well, <laughs> 12 minutes is too much? Yes, because I begin yesterday. I know, I know. Began. Yeah, you began yesterday. I know that, but th that's why I want your all of your input, right? So, um, okay. So that for some people that's too much. What about the others? What do you guys say? It's about, okay. 15 minutes, you said, right? Oh, no, 12. Oh, it's okay. 12. I guess that is okay, 12. 12? Okay. All right, so I'll, I'll give you guys 12. And like I always do, I'll come and I'll ask you, do you need more time? Are you almost finished? If I see the majority of you guys are finished before, you know, 12, the 12 minutes will stop the, 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 will stop the, the groups. But if, um, if you need more time, I can also give you more time. Okay. So let's uh, make the, the groups. I'm going to stop sharing and I'm going to create the groups that you guys had be yesterday. Okay. So it's not, so that way you guys um, continue in the same groups. So just give me a moment. Well, okay. So So in group number one, I had um, Javid, but Javid is not here. I had Juan Francisco and Warner. Okay. In group two, I had Andres and Natalie. Natalia. Okay, in group number three, I had Josue, 
and jury. Okay. In group four, I had uh, Edgar Menjivar. Edgar Menjivar and Ivan. And Ivan. Okay. Um, Okay, and um, in group five, I had Haiti with, with Jose Ayala. In group six, I had Luis with Wendy. In group seven, I had Ana Claudia, mm -hmm. Irvin. Yes. And then I guess um, Irene and Yvonne were not here yesterday, but you girls can work together and create your own um, checklist right now. Does that sound good? I will. I'll, I can come over and I can help you with that. Okay. 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 Um, just one moment. Okay, so I said 15, uh, 12 minutes and we're gonna start now. Um, you have any problems? Ivan, are you having problems to connect? Police, 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 old chef washes hands using soap from. Okay. Teacher, uh, the procedure is about uh, hand washing or any procedure that we want. Okay. Um, this is based on um, the exercise from page 24. So. Uh -huh. For exercise number five. Mm -hmm. Do you have it? Yes. Yes. All right. So, um, second. We want to do something about our workplace, right? Um. Yeah. This is second kid. No puedo salir de pantalla completa. Just give me a moment. <laughs> ah, mi computadora o sea. ¿Qué le pasa esto? No puedo salir de acá. ¿Cómo se sale de que pantalla completa? Alguien sabe. Escape, escape, and then you how up some icon uh, remove remove pin ah pero ya ya creo que ya hoy sí hoy sí ya regresé a ustedes okay es que no miraba nada más que la otra pantalla okay um all right so dónde estamos oh dónde está twenty four Page 24. 
Yeah, it's just that I can't see it to, to be able to share with you guys, with you girls. I don't know why it's not allowing me to share. Maybe it's because it's on full screen. Hmm. That's weird. I don't know what's going on. Hmm. Okay. Anyway. Okay. So let me open it. Like, first up at the comic. Okay. Sorry, girls. The computer is se está revelando. Hmm. Okay, pero ya, ya entre poquito, ya con que se. se. Ah, chicas, una preguntita. Ah, uh, no tengo, eh, o sea, no, no, no. No sé quién mandó el, el correo de, um, o hecho el correo, el, el mensaje en el grupo. Ustedes pueden ver ahí quién es. Solo ¿Sí? veo que las iniciales dice JB. Sí, ajá, es JB, pero no sé qué será. No, no, no lo tienen, ¿verdad? No saben quién es. No. Ok. Ok. Es ok. All right. So I'm going to share my screen right now. Um, okay, so now you should be able to see it. Um, okay, all right, there we go. So this is this is a checklist that we saw yesterday, right? Um, this is for a hand washing procedure, but this is just an example, right? Um, so. It, this is like a like a checklist where you can go yes 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 right so you can do a, a checklist for um, any procedure that is done in your in your workplace any procedure at all it doesn't have to be for hand washing any other procedure that you do at your at your workplace does that make sense okay yes okay. all right Okay, so go ahead. Um, you still have a few minutes, so you can go ahead. Just choose one procedure. Don't choose a lot, just one. Okay. okay. Thank you. Thank you. You're welcome. Okay. Uh, the, the, the process, the, the entries are, are, are work. Uh, the after the is the process and uh, the U office. Follow before and entering the office. Yes. Yes, before. Before. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. It, uh, I had a question. Okay. Uh, I don't know, uh, is this toilet, this form, and the chest lid? Hmm? Está bien, así el chest lid, o oh. sería de otra forma. Yeah, that's, that, that's wonderful. Mm -hmm. um, just make sure the all the verbs are in the third person singular. So, for example, in, we have reports, in uh, that one, reports, right? Because you're checking. Si reporta tal cosa, él o ella lo reporta, right? No. Uh, and the same thing with the last yeah. one. Disinfects her, his or her shoes. Porque usted está evaluando si esa persona hace eso o no. Any other questions? 
Mm, not teacher. Okay. Uh, not, uh, only teacher is uh, in work case in my company, there is a person for report a proceedings. Okay. Uh, is um, the, the person, the check and, uh, and the, what is it? Um, and the check name, the, uh, the person and uh, the check the procedures uh, after the, uh, after the entrance and uh, after the, the entrance uh, work. After entering, mm -hmm. yes. yeah. So they have to ha do the checklist, right? And say, did they do it? Yes or no? Mm -hmm. oh, okay, teacher. Yeah. Yes, yes. Siempre <laughs> report. Okay, good. Thank you, teacher. All right, see you guys, see you guys in a moment. Okay, teacher. Hi, Josue. Is, do you have a partner? Hi, teacher. I am driving. That's why I, I can yeah. help by all, a lot. Yeah, okay. Um, yeah, that's why I was I was concerned because I just realized that you were the one that sent the message to the WhatsApp group. So I wanted to know if you were if you were actually connected or what was going on. Um, I shared the procedure in my workplace. Okay. I am going to connect it late, maybe when So, so can you, so Josue, you will be able to present? Yeah. Yeah, okay. Right. You guys finished? I finished. Okay. All right, perfect. Okay, great. Yeah, because we have about a little bit more than a minute left. So um, I'll see you guys in the main room in, in, in a bit. Okay. Okay. I was, I, was, I was working here and let the dogs Okay. I seen the I yeah. <laughs> I, I sorry, never think sorry. that was you, Edgar. I, I think it was the teacher, neighbor. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, um, wow. No, o sea, to be honest, Edgar, I will be very, very honest with you. O sea, se lo voy a decir en español. Mis respetos, Edgar, mis respetos, porque eh, sé, sé que, que, que usted pues, tiene muchas distracciones a su alrededor. Pero usted ahí está, uh, tratando, o sea, a pesar de todas esas distracciones, tratando de quitarse todas esas distracciones y, y de poder estar en clase. Y realmente lo felicito por eso. Lo felicito porque no es fácil. Habían estado tranquilos los perros hasta que ingresó la ficha y empezaron a, a, a ladrar. Entonces yo pensaba que, era, que eran los vecinos suyos, no los de él. Ay, no, no te diga. Uh -huh. <laughs> Ay, no. no, no, pero no, en serio, o sea, todos tenemos las condiciones eh, que quisiéramos, ¿verdad? Pero, pero eh, pues, el hecho de que usted esté aquí tratando, o sea, muestra su, su interés, ¿verdad? Y también, y, igual, y, igual, yo sé que a veces ahí tiene obligaciones uh, como papá, ¿verdad? Y, pues, para igual, lo, lo felicito, ¿verdad? Por su, su gracias, 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 teacher. La verdad que el, 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 el esfuerzo al, al final va a lograr sus frutos y, y, y esperamos llegar a, a, a esa meta, ¿sí? Exacto. Eh, esto, eso, Edgar, eh, siga viendo la meta final. Eh, eh, o sea, todos aquí, o sea, madre, mi hermano, queremos tirar la toalla porque uno va a decir, ¿y esto qué? Y, o, o, por ejemplo, a veces los horarios se ponen... Se, pien, se ponen locos ¿verdad? y bueno a veces pero el hecho de que de que pensemos 
quiero, quiero esto por esta razón. O sea, tiene una meta y enfocarse en esa meta, al final va a valer la pena. Todo sacrificio eh, donde pues, la, el final es algo mayor, vale la pena. ¿Verdad? Sí, sí. Sí, claro. Yo siempre, yo siempre digo, el sacrificio, solo, o sea, un sacrificio solo vale la pena si, eh, si el valor va a ser mayor al final, ¿verdad? Bueno, y realmente no es un sacrificio que si te deja algo bueno por algo mejor. ¿Verdad? Entonces, entonces eh, siempre se va a tener que dejar algo bueno, ¿verdad? Pero. Lo, lo, la pregunta es, ¿vale la pena? Para que si vale la pena, pues hay que seguir. ¿Ok? So, good. Okay, are you guys ready? Are you finished? Yes. Yeah. Yes, teacher. Okay, good. I will see you in the main room in a moment. Okay, okay. thank you. Thank you, teacher. <laughs> Ya había que sacar el mano a los perritos. A la entrada y a la salida. Casualidades. Casualidades, perros. Okay. Ay, Iván, me, ¿y qué pasó? Me tenía que introducir. Para la clase. Fisher is in the house now. All right. For thanks. the first one. All right. Thanks. Okay. Good, good. All right. So I'm guessing you guys are finished. That's what I'm guessing. Am I right? We need one hour more. Yes, teacher. What? Yes, teacher. Yes, teacher. Yeah? Yes, teacher. Okay. Yes, teacher. All right. Good, good, good. Okay. Um, in that case, what we're going to do is we're going to be checking um, with everybody. We're going to be um, presenting um, your checklist, okay? Um, and seeing if, if you were going to also evaluate the checklist. So look at your classmates checklist and see, does it make sense? It, is it something that could work? or not, okay? So we're gonna start with um, directly with the groups in order. So the first group in order is Juan Francisco and Warner. Okay, teacher, uh, can I share my screen? Of course, yes, of course you can. Okay, thank you. Uh, teacher, um, um, in my group, uh, we think about the procedures um, to follow before entering the office. Um, the, the step to follow, and she or he wears face mask and she or he changed the face mask for a new one. And she or he checks her or his temperature on the forest head. And the next Werner, tell me. Werner? Werner. 
Yes, in, yes, uh, Juan Francisco. Um, yes, in my uh, case, in, in for uh, company is uh, there is a person, uh, there is a person reporting the, the procedures, uh, the entrance, the training rooms, um, temperature measurements, wipe down your nails and temper temperature. Um, there is um, there is gates uh, to choose. Uh, it's also not report uh, in the entry trainers area and the back students are are be dispensed of an alfersian field out a bitacot of all people trainer and start and the start time. Okay, um, Werner, I have a question. What did they have to fill in? I'm sorry, teacher, repeat, please. You said that they had to fill something. What, what is it that they have to fill? Uh, no, no, not the fill. It's um, um, teacher, is is. Es como tienen que llenar una bitácora, o sea, es, uh -huh. es okay, so, yeah, so yeah. fill out, fill fill out, ah yes, fill uh, out what, is, what do they have yes. to fill out? Fill out a bitácora, sí. Okay. Of how the people say, and trainers. How do you say bitácora in English? Bitácora. How do you say that? Any ideas? Bitácora. Bitácora. I don't know. Logo. Sorry? Hello. Log, yes, a log. 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 So it's actually easier. It's easier in, in, in English. Log. Log. Yes, sorry. But log, like a, like a, log is a, no, it's como tronco, no. Yes, it can, it, yes, it can also be uh, un tronco, you're right. But it, <laughs> Also, you log in in the computer. <laughs> yeah, that's a verb. Log in. Log in. Okay. We need the in. Yes, but just log can be a noun. Uh -huh. It means um, tronco or uh -huh. tronco. Yeah, like a, like no rama. Uh, no, no rama. No branch. Uh, no. Uh -huh, that's a branch. Ah, sí, branch and rama. Uh -huh. Log uh, tronco. So, no? Un trozo de, de, de madera. Tronco. Sí, un tronco es. Sí, trozo de madera, un tronco, sí. Ah, okay, you guys understand. Anyways, um, yeah, so it could be that, or if you're talking about um, something that you complete uh, by writing, that's a log as well. Okay, so it really depends on, on the context. Okay? Okay. All right. Good, um, excellent. What do you guys think about that um, about that checklist? You like it? You think it's a good checklist? It's a good checklist. I like it. Okay, good, good. I like it too. Juan Francisco, would you do me a big favor of put uh, um, sharing again your checklist okay thank you um i want you to notice something and and i actually asked him to do this on purpose if you notice he says he or she wears face mask he or she oh sorry i should say changes right changes the face mask for a new one he or she checks his or her uh, temperature on the forehead, he or she reports, et cetera, et cetera. You guys get the idea, right? So here what we're doing is when we're creating a checklist, it should be in the third person singular, 
okay so if we're checking for another person right mm -hmm. so it should be like mm -hmm. he or she and does this right and you're going to be using the third person singular in the simple present form right so what do they do does that make sense yeah mm -hmm. uh, so, so. <laughs> yeah okay thank you thank you juan francisco for sharing you can you can stop sharing now Okay, so does that make sense for everybody? We understand. Yes. Okay, I'm hoping I, I'm hoping I'm, I'm I'm being clear with the checklist. What I because the checklist in order for for a checklist to work. Um, you have to, if, if you're evaluating another person, you're talking to that person, you're evaluating that person. So it has to be, you're saying he does this or he doesn't do this. She does this or she doesn't do this. Okay, so that's why it should be in the third person singular. Sound good? Is, are there any questions about that? No? Okay. Let's move on to Andres and Natalia. Okay, I share the screen. Wonderful. Okay, can you see me? Um, I can't, we can't see it yet, but we will soon, I think. Okay. I see my computer. Yes. yes. Okay. Well, uh, our check list is about the procedures before to get in the building in our workplace so the first step is take the temperature in the automatic thermometer then uh, andres then uh, put the alcohol gel in hands. And then dissolve the alcohol gel between fingers and palm of hands. Teacher, and for this step, I have a I have a do, I have a doubt, sorry for that. Because okay. this the correct uh, word is palms of hand or palm of hands. The plural, I don't know if it's in the palms or in the hands. Um, both. Um, both. Oh, okay. Palms okay. of the hands. Okay. How about that? Also. Palms of the hands. Yes. Mm -hmm. And then, Andres. Then put the shoes on the rock with sanitizer. Mm hmm. And the, the fifth step, the long fifth step, is put the shoes on the dry rock and then get in the building. Wonderful. All right. Very good. Excellent. Bravo. Okay. Stop. Don't stop sharing yet. Okay. Okay. So, according to what I just explained of making the checklist, what would you have to do to, in order to create this checklist? Um, so that it makes it's easier to be able to evaluate it. What do you got to do? Uh, I I didn't understand. I don't. Maybe understand. Uh, put them in order for one, two, one, two, three, four, five step. No. Um. That's not. I mean, you could if you want. Um. That's that would be okay, but it's not necessary. But there is something else that you do need to do in order to make the checklist. To uh, mark the, the market. Ah, market. Mm, no. Okay, remember what I told what I just talked about uh, when Juan Francisco shared his checklist? What did I say? How do you have to how do you have to word it? A third third person teacher. Exactly. Third person. Um, okay. So you're you don't you don't have to put he or she, 
but you do have to make sure that the verb is in the third person singular. Mm, okay. Takes boots. Um, something like that. Exactly. Okay. It's yes. takes. Uh, yeah. Ah, yes. Yeah. Yeah. Temperature. Mm -hmm. Puts the alcohol. Uh huh. Yes. Exactly. That's mm. that's how it would be. Mm -hmm. That's perfect. Okay. So is that the 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 is like uh, the noun you should you the verb is uh, supreme the nouns with that with the s no it, it, because it's a checklist because it's not a sentence if it was a complete uh -huh. sentence you would have to put he or she but it's it's just a checklist it's not really a sentence okay, okay? thank you teacher yeah. <laughs> You're welcome all right so do does this clear is is this clear for everybody does this make sense yes yeah yes Okay, perfect. All right, thank you very much, guys. Excellent. Okay, let's move on to our next group. Uh, the next group was Josue with jury, right? But right. I don't see right. jury. So Josue, you're gonna have to present alone. Yeah. Um, I make the same mistakes with uh, the pairs, but I'm going to share my screen. Okay, no problem. Uh, that is a procedure in my workplace. We are uh, scanning vehicles and we have the checklist with eight procedure. Um, first is checked documents in the systems. And second one, uh, give income to the truck into the enclosure. Then check. Uh, teacher, I have a question. Uh, placas de vehículos is plates. Yes, uh, you can. Uh, plates? Yes. Plates. You can, it's, I mean, you can shorten it to plates, but it would be better if you put license plates. Oh, I didn't know that because I used it all every day that word plates. Yeah, license plates. Oh, okay. Thank you. And could you spell that? License, uh, sure. Oh, license, license. License, a licencia. License. With C or, or license? Yeah, I'm, I'm only spelling it right now. Just give me a moment. License. So license. Okay. Truck license plate. Okay, this is procedure. And um, then we save the truck weight mm -hmm. and then start scanning uh, the sequencing, review imaging quality. Uh, after that, associate radioscoping imaging with document in the system. And finally, give exit to the truck of the enclosure. Um, I have a problem with the uh, verb um, in every procedure. Right, okay, so what are you gonna do? I think it checks and uh -huh. if... Yes. Check and save. Yes. And I think it's the same in the order. Right. And that's it, it's a procedure for scanning vehicles. Number six and number seven would also have to be in the third person. Star S with no, no. Like that. only one S. Mm -hmm. It's yeah. only, and only an S. Yeah, just the S there. Okay. Perfect. All right, excellent. Yeah, that's wonderful. Sounds very good. Thank you very much, Josue. Okay. I just want to make sure that you guys understand why you have to put the third person singular. It's because this is an evaluate, uh, it's an evaluative checklist. It's not a checklist for you to say, oh, I need to know what I have to do. This is not for that. It's, a, it's an, a list for somebody to evaluate you on, on if you're doing it right or wrong. Does that make sense? Right? So because somebody is evaluating you, they have to report, oh yes, 
hizo tal cosa, hizo esto, hizo eso. Ah, no, no hizo este. But if you are, if this was something, if it was just a checklist for yourself, you wouldn't put third person singular. Does that make sense for everybody? Yeah. Sorry, yes. I repeat the, the last, the, the last okay. if, idea. If it was just a checklist to like a reminder, okay, you, this is the procedure that you have to follow. If it was just a checklist for that, then you don't put in the third person singular. But it, it would be more in the imperative, haga esto, haga esto, haga el otro, right? That would be uh, the checklist. But in right now, we're not looking at um, a checklist for procedures. What we're doing is uh, we're doing a, what's it called? Just give me a second. An evaluation checklist. That's what we're doing right now. Okay. So an evaluation checklist means that somebody is evaluating you. Does that make sense? Yeah. So yes. that's a difference because we've seen we've seen checklists before, but the checklist that we've seen before is just simply okay. Your the procedures are this. You got to do this, 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 and that. But right now we're not looking at that kind of checklist. We're looking at the checklist that where you are have to evaluate another person to see if that person is following the procedures or not. Okay. All right, great. Um, so let's move on to group number four, which is Edgar, Menjivar, and Ivan. Okay. Um, start? Sure, yeah. whenever you're ready. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, producer. Uh, producer to enter the company. The company's uh, uh, there is a just question. Um, did you did you create the checklist? Yeah. Okay. Yes. Uh, let me share. Please let me share. Okay. All right. That would be my one. Screen. Mm -hmm. oh, okay. <clears throat> yeah. Oh, go ahead, Edgar. Okay. Um, office, office uh, entrance, entrance and protocol. Um, step one: take uh, take your temperature. 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 Okay. And number two: uh, apply alcohol alcohol gel in your hands. Number three: wipe your shoes on the car on the carpet at the main entrance. Um, you, Eva? Um, and then wearing a face mask in, is always always mandatory. All meetings must be virtual. Um, clean the workspace before starting work, last and not least. Get your morning coffee, get, boys. That's all. Uh, <laughs> Natalia Groups. Is that part we, of? We don't copy you. <laughs> is, is getting your coffee part of the protocol? Yes. Oh my goodness. Okay, that I like that job. <laughs> Wake up. Okay. All right. Sounds good. That's excellent. Okay. Before you stop sharing, Ivan, I need you to tell me what do we need to do to change this list to make it an evaluation checklist? Mm. From, remember what we just explained? Maybe so the... Checklist for, to tell you what are procedures you have to do. This is a checklist for you, for somebody to evaluate if you're doing things correctly. Yes, um, maybe the form okay. to use the, the person. Uh -huh. I, don't, I don't know, no. Okay. Edgar, do you have any ideas? 
take, take your te te temperature, is uh, evaluate. Okay, this is the, this. remember somebody is going to evaluate you and they're gonna say, basically mm -hmm. they're gonna say, Edgar se está tomando la temperatura? So is that, they're evaluating mm -hmm. you. They're not telling you to do that. They're evaluating if you are following the protocol. Okay. So how would you change it? Yes, that definitely we're going to have to change. The yes. door would definitely have to change. Yes, absolutely. Okay, we got it, teacher. So could you, can you, can you tell me how you would change it? Uh, taking, no. Okay, first let, let's, let's, let's break it down. First of all, let's take the verb. The verb in the third person, singular, what is it? Takes. Takes, good. Okay, that's the first thing you gotta do. You gotta change the verb take to takes. Okay? Oh, yeah. Okay. Now, takes, takes now, your. Good. After takes. that, after you've changed the, the verb, the second thing is you can't say your, right? Because we're not talking about you, we're talking about he or she. We're trying to evaluate another person. So they're gonna take whose temperature? Mm -hmm. Hmm. Okay. La temperatura de quién? of people everybody anyone or everybody right okay so but we're evaluating a, another person so we're gonna say take <laughs> what takes what whose temperature so okay let's say ivan you are going to be evaluating me okay you're gonna evaluate the teacher you're going to evaluate if the teacher has taken her, her temperature. Oh, exactly. Her temperature. Or if it's a man, for example, you're evaluating Edgar, you're going to say his, his, temperature. his temperature. So there are two things you can do with this one. You can either say takes her or his temperature. Or the second thing, and I, I think I've mentioned this in the past, but I'm going to mention it again because you probably have forgotten. When we don't know in English, when we don't know if the person is a female or a male, like we don't know who you're going to be evaluating, if it's, if it's going to be a man or a woman, we just simply say, we use the, the, the pronoun they. <clears throat> okay? Thanks. So in this case, it would be takes their temperature. Okay. Because we don't know if it's a girl or a boy or a man or woman. Takes uh, with the S. Ah, okay. I thought because of the there. No, ah, okay. it's because of she or he. I know. Yeah, it's because the word there is actually mm -hmm. there. It's the word there is there. It's involved in both. Uh -huh. <laughs> because yes, you don't know if it's a he or she. He or she, exactly. But, but it's not because it's it comes from they as a person. Can be also, if they want to switch it, they can also write takes he, she, temperature. If you want, yeah. Like I said, you have two options. You either put he or she, sorry, his or her, or you put there, whatever you prefer. Okay. Does that make sense for everybody? Does that make sense? So in that case, yes. it takes their temperature. Takes their temperature. It's because you say it's a evalu check, evaluation checking, right? Yes, an evaluate, 
Yes, and it's an evaluation checklist. You are evaluating another person to see if they are doing the, the procedures the way they are supposed to do the procedures. Okay? All right. And okay. you continue. I'm not, I'm not going to make you change all of them. But um, basically, with number two, you would say applies alcohol gel on his or her hands or applies alcohol gel on their hands is okay too, right? Uh, the same thing, anything that, that you have the word your, you're gonna have to change it to his or her or their, right? Um, and number four, you would just simply say, wears a face mask or where, always wears a face mask, probably would be better. Always wears a face mask, okay? Um, Number five, you would say, like, for example, uh, it could be attends all virtual meetings, maybe attends all virtual meetings, right? And so on. Right? Does that make sense for everybody? Yeah. Okay. I just, I'm asking you guys because I, I want to make sure that. You guys um, understand this, that I'm not confusing you. Okay. All right. And if you guys want uh, for the groups that are remaining, since you already know what you have to do, um, you can just go ahead and do make the changes. Okay. All right. Thank you, Ivan, for presenting. You can stop presenting if you want, because right now we're going to be taking attendance once again. So we'll start with Ana Claudia. Present teacher. Okay. Javit. Present teacher. Excellent. Um, Andres. Present. All right. And uh, then it's Fernando. Edgar Menjivar. Present teacher. All right. Um, Edith Jorleni. Irvin. Present teacher. All right. Uh, Fabiola, Haiti, present teacher. All right. Um, Irene, present teacher. Okay. Josue, present teacher. All right. Juan Francisco, present teacher. Okay, good. Jury, present teacher. Excellent. Uh, Luis. Present teacher. Great. Manuel Alejandro. Natalia. Present teacher. Excellent. Wendy. Present. All right. Werner. Present teacher. Excellent. Yvonne. Present. Excellent. Uh, Edgar. Edgar Enriquez. Edgar? No? Okay, Eli? Eli? No? Okay. Uh, Jose? Jose Montes? Jose Montes? And Jose Ayala? Present teacher. All right. Okay. Present teacher, you don't say my name. Ivan. No, dije su nombre. No. I'm sorry. Okay, sorry. No Ivan. problem. Present teacher. <laughs> Good. Okay, sorry about that, Ivan. I'm so sorry I missed your name. No problem. All right, let's move on. We're going to continue with group number five, which is Haiti and Jose Ayala. Okay. I hope I will be able to share. Okay. Can you see it? Yes, we can. Uh, our checklist is to record rates on time deposits. It's, uh, I feel like uh, I was making the checklist like uh, the ones that uh, when the auditors come to our branch, they pass, right? So yes, no issues, the list of monthly renewals, yes, yeah. no negotiates with customers interest rates for next period, mm -hmm. yes, no obtains authorization for interest rates outside the delegation. Yes, no, records interest rates on time deposits. 
and yes, no for dual control verifies that the interest rates were recorded correctly. Wonderful. All right, that's perfect. Very, very good. And you have the verbs in the right, in in the right form, and that way it's easy for the, like for example, the auditor, like you were you were mentioning, the auditor. It's easy for them to say, okay, yes or no, right? Very, very easy. Excellent. Okay. Very, very good. Thank you. Thank you, group. Uh, group number, what was you were? Group number five. All right. Thank number, you. Number five, I guess. I made my own teacher too. Oh, really? Okay. Okay. Yes. You want to share it then? Yes, teacher. Let okay. me share the screen. Just one moment, please. Okay, okay no problem. Okay, do you see it? We can. Yes, okay. So uh, this process is when a customer calls to verify why the programming doesn't allow and say that they need a subscription because I'm work with a uh, TV service too. And first, ask for his or her number. Uh, I don't know if it's, that's okay. Yeah, that's fine. Uh, to check if the subscription is canceled, if yes, uh, we have to continue. If not, the follow the troubleshoot step to solve the issue. And then ask about the, what kind of programming they like to watch, uh, send a text message for a customer to fill up uh, the person information because it was, uh, we run a credit check as the device that's going to be used uh, to connect your TVs and then read the term and condition and send the text message or email to the customer accepted. Uh, educates that going to receive an email and how to will create uh, the user ID and password. And that's it. Wonderful, that's perfect, great. Uh, the only thing maybe the one in parentheses, the number one, make sure mm -hmm. that verb is also in third person. That's the only the only observation. So if not, mm -hmm. what's the verb? If not, uh -huh. what's the verb? What's the verb in that? Follow. Yeah. This one. Right. Follow. Yes, exactly. That's it. Okay. That's my only observation. Very good. Excellent. Very very good. Thank you very much. Group number six. Okay, oh no, yes, no, group five, sorry, group five. Okay, great. All right, let's go now to group number six, Luis and Wendy. It's okay, I'm gonna share my... Yeah. Okay. You see? You can, yes. Okay. Uh, this is a, a photocopier use procedure. <clears throat> I make sure uh, the photocopier has enough paper. Log in with user code assigner. Select the print or copy task. Logs out at the end of process. Set energy say mode of copier. And the last turn of the room light. Excellent. Very, very good. That's perfect. Very good. Thank you very much, uh, group number six. Okay. Sure. Okay. All right, group number seven, Anna Claudia and Irvin. Okay, teacher. Uh, well, we made a simple process, uh, four steps for uh, uh, the process when you start your shift. Uh, the first step is logs in his or her computer on time. Uh, second is checks. Sorry, Sorry to interrupt. Uh, did you guys do anything um, digital so that you can share? Okay, all right, never mind that. Uh, okay, uh, then the second is, uh, checks uh, emails 
And then the third one is, um, I have a, we have a doubt in that word, contact uh, or calls. We use better calls, custom, uh, their customers and follow up requests. And the fourth step, it will be check status for order places the day before. I don't know if check must be with checks. Right, check. Checks there. Mm -hmm. uh, okay. Yeah. Checks their orders placed the day before. Ah, uh, okay. Perfect. Okay. Good. All right. Um, is that it or? No, no, that's it. It's a simple procedure for when you get into the office and log into the computer. Okay. Uh, Urban, were you going to say something or is that it? What is that? <clears throat> oh, yeah. Okay, perfect. Yeah. Excellent. We have the similar, similar procedures for that reason. Yeah. We no, that's fine. That's fine. That's perfect. I just wanted to make sure. Okay. <laughs> Very good. Bravo. Okay. And group number eight, uh, which is uh, Irene and Yvonne. Okay, teacher. Uh, our procedure is about biosafety at the beginning of work. Um, step number one is keeps a safe distance with other people before enter to the building. Uh, number two, froze the face mask in the trash can. Number three, takes temperature in the forehead with digital thermometer. Uh, number four takes, uh, oh, oh, no, oh, uh, I'm sorry, hand sanitization. And number five takes a new face mask. And the last one gets into the building. Yeah, that's perfect. Mm -hmm. Thank you very much. Okay. Thank you. Uh, were you going to mention something, Irene? Or is, is that it? In the same procedure for our company, we work together. Oh, okay. Okay. All right. That, well, that made it so much easier for you. Okay. <laughs> Good. That's wonderful. Okay. Well, thank you. Thank you, guys. All right, so I think you guys got the, the hang of this. Um, yeah, but you guys um, understood it. If you noticed, um, I spent a little bit more time on the first groups simply because I needed to explain some things, but um, once you guys understood it, well, everything just went really quickly, right? So that's great. Anything you guys wanna ask me about before we continue? No, teacher. You sure? Okay. All right. No problem. In that case, we're going to move on to the next part in our um, PowerPoint. Just give me a moment. Okay. So tell me if you're able to see it. Yes, teacher. Okay. Yes. Great. So um, here we have two questions that I want you to think about. What is your daily schedule like at work? Okay, so what? Think about your work. What happens when you get to work? What do you do? Uh, you know, what protocols you have to follow maybe before you get in the building? Um, what do you do during the day? Do you have certain things that you ha always have to do every day? Um, you know, and what time do you finish, et cetera, et cetera. And who is in charge of organizing staff schedules in your company? So every, I'm sure everybody in your company has different schedules. So who's in charge of organizing those schedules? I want you to, we're going to be going to groups and I, sorry, uh, yeah, we're to breakout rooms, better said, and you're going to be working in pairs, 
to talk about these questions, okay? All right, so let's create the breakout rooms. And I'm going to give you, this time I'm gonna give you five minutes because, you know, just two questions to discuss it. I think you'll, you'll, you should be able to, to, um, to do that in five minutes. So let me see. Okay. All right, here we go. Let's open up the rooms. Ivan, are you having problems? Page uh, 25, what is your daily schedule like at work? Okay. Is the first question, what is your daily schedule? Like a work. Uh -huh, in, my case, uh -huh. in my case, in my case, never is the same because mm -hmm. all day. So you have a, you have a schedule, but never com completing the schedule. Yes. Mm -hmm. Sometimes, uh, in my case, I complete because I have agenda, mm -hmm. but uh, may sometimes have a little problem or little meeting, don't stay mm -hmm. in this schedule on my, my agenda. Okay. And uh, the time is not, uh, the time is short for the, all the <laughs> activities. For my for my for my daily for my weekdays, for example, my schedule is Q, uh, Monday to Friday. I I have. Uh, to work 6, 7 a.m. to 4 30. But I, during the day, I don't have any schedule like uh, in order. For example, I have to, to eat my lunch in 30 minutes, but I decided what time, what time. In the breakfast too, I I have 15 minutes in the morning to eat my my breakfast, but I decided the time. For example, I can eat seven, eight, or nine. In all the schedule for lunch and breakfast to all the people in the plant, for example. We have around 1,700 people in the plant and they have to organize the, the hour of lunch and breakfast for all the people. There's a lot of people in the plant. Yeah, but, but we have uh, four plants and I think, uh, Santa Ana plan have more people that 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 the, the people that we have in the in, in my plan. I think in Santa Ana plan are around two thousand people 
uh, in in the working working there. There are a lot of people. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, for example, uh, the hour of lunch start at uh, eleven a.m. and finish. Um, I think uh, one. 1 p.m. 1 p.m. Yeah, 1 p.m. And and I think it's because we have only 30 35 minutes to to take the lunch. Okay. Um, sometimes it's it's hard time to have a lunch. Um, yes, because it's because uh, we have 45 minutes uh, for one hour to spend. If we don't have a uh, vehicle to spend, I can, uh, I have one hour to take a lunch, take a break of lunch. Yeah, and, and imagine, do you have 35 minutes? Uh, starting uh, the, uh, at the end of you leave your, your machine or your workplace. How's it? What? El encargado, ¿quién es? Hey, who's in charge of the organization staff to schedule or in your uh -huh. company? In this case, for example, we have many structures. Um, us, and for example, there is a manager of I, there is a manager of IT department from different countries. Um, in the, this country, we have another principal uh, in charge of the IT department just from El Salvador. Um, but the person, the, the, the schedule of the company that we have. The fencing and the speciality of code. Coach, what? Coach. Sorry. Uh, coach the fencing and in speciality of the fencing, the foil, yes. Special. 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 Specialty of special. the foil. So not, a, not speciality, but specialty. Specialty mm -hmm. uh, the foil. Uh, the, the, and fencing of the three arms, one epe, uh, second sables, and um, uh, foiled uh, is, is on the three arms. Okay. Yes, uh, my thanks. The work is uh, for the, the trainers is the three uh, PMs on the eighth, uh, finally, eight PMs. Uh, the train is of uh, the national team, yeah. Seniors okay. and, and juniors, yeah. Taking pictures, uh, verifying if we, not for the productivity, they're, they're, they are going to be pictures showing if uh, there is someone else near to your working area, because remember we handle uh, sensitive information like uh, customer address information, uh, sometimes credit card numbers, checking accounts. And that webcam, it will be taking some pictures and verifying if the information or my working area space is not at risk. So they were explaining all of that today. So, mm -hmm. I guess, and. They make uh, the factor, yes, the, the, the who made choice. But yes, hello teacher. Hello guys. Are you finished or do you, are you still talking? Uh, uh, we are we already finished. finished. Talking about something. You're talking about other things. 
Huh? You're talking about other things. Yeah, yeah. The, another. Okay, no problem. I'll see you in the main room in a moment. Yes, okay. teacher. Perfect. Um, oh, I, 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 I apply to uh, a job. The, 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 the time and in, in call center? I have the, 10 year. years working there. 10 years? Yeah, 10 years. Um, very good. We, we already <laughs> talked about the, the question, teacher. We already finished to talk about that. Okay. The question. That's why we are talking about other topics, but okay, okay. Yeah, let's go. Where, where where do you work? At Concentrics. Oh, okay, okay. You've been working there for ten years. Yes, I have been working for ten years there. Wow. Mm -hmm. Okay. There are a lot of a lot of time. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. So I'm guessing you like it then. Uh yes. The yeah the environment in school. So good, good. But you're working from home or are you work? Yes, I'm working. No, I'm working from home since the pandemic, pandemic yeah. So. Or you were on site. What? Or you were on site. Yeah, before I were on site. Right. I'll see you guys in the main room in a moment. Okay. Okay. She's here now, almost leaving. Okay. <laughs> not, not yet. We're not leaving yet. There's still like almost half an hour left. Okay. All right. So, um, I I said five minutes, but um, I gave you more time because when I was visiting the groups, I noticed you guys were, you were, you know, really into your conversation and I didn't want to interrupt you. So I give you guys a little bit more time. All right, very good. So tell me, who is in charge of making the schedules at your workplace? Okay, in my, in my work, we have one analyze uh, to give the schedule to every agent. So they analyze uh, if what is the average of every hours because we handle the hours uh, like if you lost a call or something like that. So uh, first they have to analyze that information and then uh, they provide the schedule for every agent. Okay, sounds good. What about the others? Who organizes your schedule at your workplace? In my in my case, the principal, because he needs to um, observe the observe all observe all the schedule because uh -huh. uh, have a uh, different materials uh, subjects subjects and then different um, teachers for each uh, topic. Ah, okay, okay, good. Does anybody have the, the opportunity and the privilege of making their own schedule? Can anybody? Erwin. Sorry? <laughs> yeah. Erwin. Yeah. All right. Oh, yes, yes. Yeah, Erwin. Erwin. Yeah. I hear Erwin. Yeah, I am here. <laughs> so, Erwin, you that big boss. <laughs> I think that uh, work hard, only that, not the boss. Work hard. Work hard. Workaholic. <laughs> Workaholic or alcoholic. 
No, work hard. Uh, ah, okay, so, okay. <clears throat> No, but workaholic is someone that just works, works, works uh, a lot. Mm -hmm. It's an addictic to work. Morning, new teacher. Yeah. <clears throat> Morning, new teacher. Thank you. I'm like, we're here talking. Um, okay. Uh, so, Irvin, can you make your own schedule? Can. <clears throat> Teacher, I mean, it's, it's so difficult to have a schedule in my boss, in my work, because I depend in one day. My personal, yes, he has a schedule, organization schedule, but in my life, in my work, I don't have a schedule. Only I have one, one thing in my mind, I seem to do all, all well, okay? I think to do all well, all, I try to find to be a perfect, this is a different to be a perfect, and the time is so much import in the in, in the one day for me. Only that. Okay, so you really don't have that that flexibility of make your own schedule. No, I don't have it. Oh. Hmm, interesting, right? So, but <laughs> but before before when I when I went to sleep in my in my in my home, I think about. Uh, tomorrow I have to do this one, I have to do all the one, I have to do this in the, the, the bank, I okay. have to call the customer, I the ask the the customer about the 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 phrase. Mm -hmm. So you make yeah. your schedule. <laughs> yes, yeah, schedule. Yeah. But but when but in the in the in the in the one day you think you will do it, but the reality is, is different. But only you have to, but in my life, only, think, only thing I had to be a perfect. I know that only world is perfect, but I try to think I to be a perfect. But, but you I know, try, that, that, <laughs> yeah. that can be a very exhausting, Irvin, trying yeah. to be perfect for everything. <laughs> You know, yeah. I mean, it's good. Yeah. I It's good to- He calls the boarding up to the employer. Sorry, what was that, Natalia? <laughs> he caused the the boring boring up to to his employers. Oh yeah, can you imagine? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Because each minute is money. Exactly. Yeah, Urban, how, how many employees do you uh, employees do you have? In, in the staff, three. Three. Three men. Three men. Job men. Young man, I think that uh, 21, 22 years old, 25 years old. Oh, young yeah, people. Yeah. Young people. Because yeah. you can do it with the young people that you want. Yeah? Because when you are, are, are old, like me, I am old. Yeah? It's so different to change how to work the person. It's so different. Yeah. yeah. But are you are you a perfectionist only for yourself or with other people too? Okay, <clears throat> I try with my personal to be uh, is mine in the world. Yeah, and in when, when you have work like like like, like my, my my business, the you know, only the work in the family is important. Okay, the family mm. is important in my work. The family is of, your, of my staff, okay? I, am, I listen if I, if I have a problem. I try to, to be a, not only the boss, no, no friends, but give me the help. This is the more important. Okay. So I try, I try. That's good. Okay. Sounds good. All right. 